Praise the Lord. Welcome to our brief Bible reflections. This is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. It is also good to acknowledge that we are in a new month, the month of August, by the grace of God. We have a reason to celebrate, to rejoice in the Lord, and to continue saying, Truly, God is our all in all. Welcome as we read from the book of Isaiah, chapter 32, verse 1 and 2. The Bible says, Behold, a king will reign in righteousness and a princess will rule with justice. A man will be a hiding place from the wind and a cover from the tempest, as rivers of water in a dry place, as the shadow of a great rock in a weary land. Praise be to God. Two things we are getting from this portion of scripture, that God's people, when we allow Christ to rule in our lives, he who rules in righteousness, when we allow him to be in charge of our lives, we shall experience protection and provision. Protection and provision. And this is why the Bible says that, you know, there will be rivers of water in a dry place. Would you be feeling like you are in a dry place today? You're going through a very hard time. The Lord being in charge of your life, he is able to provide even rivers of water in that dry situation. Secondly, the protection that has been promised is that there will be shadows even in this weary land. And so there is protection. We are not exposed. We are not alone. God is together with us. But our call, our, our responsibility is to allow Christ who rules in righteousness take charge of our lives he will lead us, he will guide us in everything, and above all, he will be there to provide for us. He will be there to protect us. Even in a dry place, he will provide rivers of water. In a weary land, he will be our shelter. Jesus is the rock, even in a weary land, because under him, under this great rock, Jesus Christ, we shall have true protection. Brothers and sisters, when we depend on God and we allow God to take charge of our, of our lives, we need not to worry. God is in charge and he's able to command situations. You know, you can imagine a dry place and the Lord is talking about rivers of water, not just drops of water, rivers of water. It is because God is in charge of everything in this world and even in heaven. He is God above everything. And so great things that are pro promised to us, brothers and sisters, that despite the challenges we come across in our Christian walk, God is always there to provide for us and to protect us. Who doesn't want to be provided for by the Lord? We all desire that the Lord may be you know, our provider who does not desire to be protected by the Lord, we all desire to remain to remain under this rock. And the rock is Jesus Christ. The Lord is calling us to release ourselves to him, to allow him be our rock and a great rock. And under him, under this rock, under this great rock, I love what the Bible says that as the shadow of a great rock, in a weary land. He will cover us. He will protect us. We shall rejoice even amidst challenges because the Lord is in charge and he knows us and he's uh, always ready to do good things to us as his children. Don't give up because you're going through a dry land. There'll be rivers of water. Don't give up because you feel as though you're in a weary land. Jesus is our shelter. He is there to protect us. Take refuge in him, call upon him, and allow him to take charge over your life. God bless you. God keep you. Let us continue trusting in this great God, a God who is ready to protect us and to provide unto our needs that as his children, we may continue rejoicing all day long. God bless you and keep you. Have a blessed time. Shalom.